Hi everyone. Today, let's talk about how to edit and run code in VS Code. I'll walk you through how to open a folder, create a new file, and use some of VS Code's key editing features. First, let's open a folder. Projects that you open with VS Code will be organized in a folder structure, which you can look through in the File Explorer. The best way to start coding in VS Code is to create a folder for your project and open it in the editor. We're going to create a new file in this folder today and write a little bit of code. We're going to use Node.js, and VS Code has support for the JavaScript and TypeScript languages, including Node.js, out of the box, but you'll need to have Node.js installed to run the code. To follow along with me, install Node.js for your platform. To check if you have it installed, open your terminal or command prompt and type node-version to see what version number you have installed. From the File Explorer toolbar, press the New File button. Name the new file app.js. By using the .js file extension, VS Code interprets this file as JavaScript and will evaluate the contents with the JavaScript language service. Let's make a string variable with the string hello world. Let's send the contents of the string to the console. Notice that when you typed console dot, IntelliSense gave you suggestions of the methods available to the console object. We can also see all of the string functions available for the message variable when we type message dot. IntelliSense is a powerful tool that gives you suggestions as you code and quick fixes for any errors you might make as you're coding. There are a couple of other key editing features that might come in handy here. If you want to automatically format your code, there's a keyboard shortcut to help you do that. If you don't want to worry about manually saving your file each time you make a change, you can turn on autosave by going to File Autosave. You'll know it's on if there's a check mark next to it. Finally, let's run our code. You can run code in your operating system's terminal or command prompt, or use the integrated terminal right in VS Code. Open up the integrated terminal by going to View Terminal. You can split the terminal, add more terminals, and even change the shell. We're going to stick with the default bash shell here. Since our app.js file is in the Files folder, we're going to want to switch into that. Then, we can type node app.js to run our app. You'll see your message, hello world, printed to the console. I hope you enjoyed following along and learning how to edit and run a small program in VS Code. Happy coding!